Hey, so in this video, I want to share with you a concept around suffering and how you can use and leverage suffering, obstacles, pain, discomfort, failure, whatever it might be, to your advantage. And if you understand this mindset shift, you can make way more progress in your life. And I've certainly done that, so I hope it serves you well. When people experience setbacks and they experience pain, what most people do rather than confront the pain, rather than use the pain, is they avoid the pain. And so what they'll do is they'll use some type of distraction to get their mind off of the pain to then feel better. And there's a huge problem in this where when you avoid the pain, the pain stays in your life right? because you do not solve it. You just distract yourself from it. You have to understand that suffering is created by yourself. It is not created through circumstance. There are circumstances which would cause more people suffering you know, comparatively because they are less positive or seen as less positive. But at the end of the day, you create your own suffering, not whatever is happening in your external world. Now, all that suffering is, is an indication that something in your present reality is either not the way it should be or your interpretation of the thing is not the way that it should be. And when I look at every person that harmed me, every person that you know hurt me in my life, every circumstance that hurt me in my life, it really has been a gift to bring myself into further expression. And when I look back at every person that supposedly harmed me, every person that you know has hurt me or every circumstance that has hurt me, it's all a gift. Every single circumstance has shifted or helped me become the person that I need to be and has helped me become who I am today. And when you see things from your past or even in your present reality as harmful things, they will stay that way. If you start to see them as gifts, they will become that way. If you look through the mirage of this obstacle without self-pity, without your ego getting in the way, and you don't escape it, you look into the demon's eyes and you accept whatever is happening without trying to get around it, that is where the level up lies. That is where you can start to create very fast iteration cycles because you are actively confronting the thing. And when you stop letting your mind distract itself from the problem, the problem will be solved because your mind is actively going through that pain, right? It feels that discomfort. It doesn't want that discomfort. And so if you actually embrace the pain, your brain will find a solution to the pain. And so I challenge you to become more mindful around this. When you experience something, just sit in the pain of it, because that's where the breakthrough lies. All of this is especially true with short-term pain. Like going to the gym, putting in more work, avoiding all of the, the, the things that your mind are telling you in the discomfort of just doing what you have to do anyways. All of these things are short-term pains but short-term pains always come with long-term pleasure. And short-term pleasures always come with long-term pains. So the more you can suffer in the present moment, the better your life will be in the long-term and vice versa. Make that change and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.